Nigerians are grappling with uh, galloping food prices, which have only worsened following the announcement by the federal government to discontinue petrol subsidy payment and the value of the official exchange rate. Plus, the crew went on a market survey to feel the polls of both buyers and sellers alike. Plus, the news correspondent Destiny Momo brings us more in this report. This is Aja Market here in Etiosa, Lagos, Nigeria. The traders as well as the consumers are complaining about prices, the price hike of commodities, and they are begging the government to ensure that things get better for the citizens. I went around the market to investigate how the biting effect of inflation is telling on their commercial activities. With a quick look at them, it is a tale of low patronage by buyers as they complain of the staggering cost of staples. <laughs> Traders lament dwindling sales. A bag of rice sells for almost 60,000 naira and a healthy cow sells for about a million naira, resulting in the price hike of beef. It's not a good at all. It's too bad. Or uh, being say today now, when we buy one market today, tomorrow, not the price of the market, we will buy it again. So everything used to dear every now and then. That is why the market is not move at all. Then she help us them, please make them we beg them. Make them help us be about this market, about the all markets, not only one market, because everything is too dear. Things are not moving well. The economy was, everything is so low. So just like pray to our government that to make, make things easy to people, so that when, when something was easy, people were like, okay, everything will germinate, but when something like, if you want to buy something, and people will just complain, this thing is too, it's too, it's too cost. The thing, <laughs> the thing make will be like that, they say, the beg governor, president, and other people, make will help us from dollar, open border. So maybe if that thing, this thing happen, everything will come down small. More expensive and the things getting out of and uh, because bag of including beans, beans, the plastic of beans now is 3,500, 4,000. Normally before it's 2,500. People are complaining. Rice now is 5,000 for plastic. Bag of rice, 60,000. Some buyers express their displeasure. This, I don't like this period we are now. Ah, the, I don't want to say more than, I just don't, I'm not enjoying the, the this period. The price that they are calling a bag of rice, I don't understand. Hey, you should help us now. We are dying. Population is very high. Petrol, petrol, one top petrol is one, 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 five, five minutes is too much. They should help us. We are dying in this country now. For real. As I continued with the survey, some pensioners complained about the palliatives promised by the federal government. They are yet to receive them. Alas, they are barely surviving amidst the hardship. We will make things good for the people. Because there are a lot of people who come to the market and there are a lot of people that cannot eat. All. If not this pension, at least it's sustaining me. Uh -huh. That's what we are really... You know, and the children, their hand is not up to, you know. So it is no, it is hard. Hey, is it the same for us that we fought for them? Is it the same? Hey, is it that we shall say? We must say it's his own talk. And we agree. We, we, we fool us. We fool Nigerians. We fool Nigerians. We cannot continue like this. At this my age, over 50, I have to be carrying my up and down because I want oh. to eat. It's oh. not done in any state. With the recent shutting down of Mile 12 and Alaba International Markets, as a result of environmental infractions, the Aloja Rovaja Market in Etiosa local government and other officials speak on how they have been able to manage their market spaces effectively. Assuming our, this market is not organized, they will just be doing everything rubbish, but we always make the government, the environmental, everything to circulate. So we don't we always obey the rules and the regulation of the government before we hear that anything wants to happen. 
We set up our everything up. Uh, from, from the first angle, you know, what to eat must be hygienic. Something you take in, you must be hygienic with it. That is why we have monitoring for uh, feed in the area of uh, environmental sanitation. We have tax force team in the area. We also have an executive that communicates in that area. Residents are hopeful of a turnaround soon as they also grapple with the poor state of roads, multiple taxations, as well as high cost of transportation. Here in Etiosa Aja Market, Lagos, Nigeria. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.